Hey guys, this is Fat Ninja from the Rogue Reapers again. Just bringing a couple, well, one more item, and I'll make another video about another item here. Uh, last video was about uh, the uh, 511 LBE vest that I use. I had a lot of great performance out of it. I briefly mentioned the STAC mag pouches that I use, and, uh, and really enjoy those mag pouches. I uh, used a couple others. I've used some tacos. I've used the fast mags, which have the little rubber bands around them. Um, and all those work fine, uh, but you would run into issues like the uh, the fast mags. Uh, I had a bad batch of rubber bands at one time, and I was breaking them like once every game or two, which is aggravating as fire when you're out doing your thing. Uh, use the uh, taco mag pouches a little bit, and they're fine. They work good. Um, I just... I wasn't real keen on the retention on them. Uh, so, went back, tried a couple extra things, and I ended up going with an STAC, E-S-S-T-A-C, uh, mag pouch. And these are pretty nice. They uh, they got, you can have them with the Molly, you can get them without the Molly. Uh, this is the mid-length. They also make them in a short, which is, I don't know, about an inch shorter. And then they make them in a long or a tall, and, uh, and they're a little bit longer and a little bit taller, of course. Uh, these work really well. I use these for my airsoft stuff. I also have them on my uh, my real steel stuff, and the retention is fine. The retention is great. Um, so, they're a lifetime warranty. I am not endorsed, like I said in another video. Uh, so, if anything ever did go wrong, rock on. Call them up, be like, hey, my stuff's bad, and I'm sure they'll figure it out. I hadn't had to do that, so I'm sure they'd figure it out though. Uh, that being said, really nice. They use a Kydex insert, which is just like this. Nothing big, nothing fancy. It's got a kind of Velcro tape on the back, uh, back side of it. And the reason they have that is because there's Velcro inside the mag pouch. So when you are using it, um, you know, if you need to replace the Kydex or if you need to clean it, you need to wash it, whatever you want to do, take it, squeeze it together, shove it into the hole like so, and spread it out and it attaches inside and it will not come out unless you run something in between there, get your fingers down in there and, and release it. Um, it does not, I think I just put that in backwards. Anyway, <laughs> we'll work it out. So it, uh, the retention on it's really nice. You know, when your mags click in, they're rock solid. It's not going anywhere anytime soon. And, uh, like I said, I've run with these things in several mill sims. I had never had one fail, never had one come out of a pouch. Um, I use it on my real steel. My real steel works great with it too. Uh, keep in mind, I'm not running around with the real steel the way I am with the airs off because I don't have people shooting real bullets at me right now, so it's fun. Um, that being said, I love these things. Fantastic pouches. If you're looking for something that's bulletproof that you don't have to worry about, Something you can slide your mags in, something that's on your vest so you can tuck it in without having to look at it, without having to open the pouch, without having to worry about retention. S Tech. You're going to have to buy the, the mouse clips. They don't come with them, but they're cheap and they're not hard to do. So, S Tech. Love it. Hate it. Either way, I love them. Uh, like I said, I've used them several big events. Uh, hit me up. Like it if you like the product and uh, let me know how it did for you.